back to my channel i'm basically at my local marshall's and i just wanted to take a look around in the cosmetic section to see if it was like totally worth it coming to shop here you know to see what kind of selections they have if they have like any high-end products if they have any type of um you know makeup that is actually worth it at a cheaper price um you'd be surprised at the stuff that i found well yeah you'd be very surprised at the stuff that i found um and that is pretty much it so stay tuned so i can show you around the store show you all the type of um makeup products that they have and pretty much they have not such a bad selection like just stay tuned for that there's my daughter back there say hi and that's my son so don't judge me i don't have any makeup but i usually don't wear makeup especially when i'm picking up my kids from school and all that stuff but let's get into the video and show you guys what i found in marshall's hi guys uh, welcome back to my mommy's channel <laughs> so we're over here so in uh, marshall's right now so checking out the makeup section i've never quite checked out the makeup section of Marshalls. It is kind of my first time. But I am finding some high-end products. Look, for example, I found the Too Faced Life A Festival palette. And the price is actually not bad. So it goes for $24.99. And the palette is up there that is $41. So that's pretty cool. Um, I did take a peek inside and it didn't look like anything was used. Mommy, look at this. I see it. Let me finish, sweetheart. It's cute. They do have more Too Faced products. I was surprised to see this in here, which I totally think that it is so worth it. This is the Anastasia Beverly Hills Aurora palette. I was looking for the price. I was looking for the price and there it is compared to $42 I would totally buy this if I don't already have it which I didn't know that they had a lot of main brand products they have a bare minerals this is sort of like an eyeshadow palette I'm guessing it comes with these colors back here and it goes for $12.99 they also have makeup revolution this is a flawless matte too And it's for $5.99. Like, seriously? Okay. I might get this. I might not. I don't know. They have more Makeup Revolution. They have Cat One D right here. The quads, basically. And these go for $9.99. Then when you come over here, they do have some more name brand products look this is smoke and mirrors i'm guessing this is a lip duo it goes for 7.99 they also have more cat londy glam go right here they even have some cover effects i'm not sure what this is is this a foundation? I'm not sure what this is. This is custom cover drops for $6.99. So that's pretty cool. They have more makeup revolution right there. Some birds and bees. They have the baked highlighter for $3.99. This is a blushing heart. I mean, I would recommend that if you are going to purchase products from here, if they're not completely sealed, do kind of open them and check them out because most of the time, they <laughs> kind of open them and like use them and stuff. Mommy, I need to use the restroom. Okay, go find a bathroom. Okay, you got Mommy, look, I, I am not gonna buy that. Why? They have some cute little makeup kits down there how much these cost 
So $5.99 for these makeup kits is not bad at all. Another brow book and it goes for $5.99. Basically comes with that little kit, which is pretty cool, I guess. What is this? The cover and conceal. So this is powder. I'm actually looking for some clean cover conceal, which is the reason why I came over here. But I figured I didn't know they had this much stuff. Look, they have NARS right here. Oh my God, I might get this. So what is this? Um, so these are the eyeshadows and they go for $7.99 from NARS. They have a Smashbox little eye palette right here, which goes for $14.99. Pretty good palettes. They have more stuff over here. I'm guessing these are brands I've never actually heard of before. Born to be a unicorn. This is actually pretty cute. It retails for $4.99. Oh, this is a really cute palette for like someone who is trying to get into makeup. It's really cute. I kind of like this for a little girl. And they have this highlighter, which I wouldn't recommend as a highlighter. They have the conceal. You know what? I might just end up getting this one because I did go for this one which is the contour and highlight which retails for $3.99 but I think I'm gonna put this back I don't even know where I got this from oh okay let's just put it right here they have bronzer sticks a highlighter Mac Studio rose gold drops for $3.99 and they have different colors so that's pretty interesting and pretty cool um a primer but i think i'm gonna give this one a try this is I, you can tell it's been swatched so i don't know if i'm gonna even buy this let's see if i find another one then over here they have i guess these are like you know makeup setting spray i don't know why it's all milky and stuff <laughs> but okay they have some Makeup remover, definite water, morning glow serum. This is um, a collagen serum for $5.99. That's pretty cool. Um, facial scrubs, toners. There's makeup wipes. Over here is a lot, also, as you can see. Like, wow. I am pretty shocked. They also have this cute display for like blenders, which I wouldn't recommend buying. But we hear there's something that caught my eye. This is like a, a makeup brush set. It is for $9.99. So that's pretty cool to come here. And like, we also have e.l.f. BB. this one's really cute too like if this if you were gonna get a gift for someone this retails for 9.99 as well Are you still with mom now? basically like i'm i'm guessing i would use this you know for powdering the face um contouring and for highlighting put that down there can i make my own channel no you're too young Sorry. and then back here they have more makeup brushes and, oh, they have little makeup brush cleaning palettes for five ninety nine. Papi, I'm doing something. Relax. You're, you're not. You know where I was at? I didn't know. I actually need one of these. I don't know if I should get one right now. But um, this is a brush color swap pad. I use this a lot when I'm interchanging, you know, colors, and I still want to use the same makeup brush so that one's pretty good they got these silicone blenders which i personally do not recommend they suck really bad oh they have body washes hand washing 
This looks pretty cool. What is this? It is from Philosophy White Pearl. This is a shampoo shower gel bubble bath. This is a body scrub for $5.99. I usually go to Ulta to get my body scrubs. But these are some uh, bath scissors. They retail for $4.99. Those are pretty cool for like gifts and stuff. So that is pretty much it when it comes to the section of um makeup oh wait hold on so i actually have one of these at home this is from real techniques and this is a brush i'm not sure i have this one but this is a foundation brush i think i'm gonna take this one i'm gonna buy it because it's one of my pretty collections i have the powder brush and i do have the blush brush and a crease blending brush i definitely think i'm gonna take this as for a concealer pad, I can't find one that is not used. So, I think that's pretty much it. So hey guys, I'm finally home and I'm gonna show you guys what I bought from uh, Marshalls. I didn't get too much stuff because I didn't have the money for it, you know. So I'm gonna go ahead and flip the camera around because you guys know that I do record on my phone. Your girl is too broke for an actual camera unfortunately so this is what i got i did see this mug like on the way out and it really caught my attention it is really really cute it says witches brew on it in the back says the same thing and uh i don't drink coffee but i do drink tea so i'm definitely gonna use this for that it did cost 4.99 so that was pretty cool i i really like my mug and i did get this found i did get this foundation brush I have been wanting to try a foundation brush with my makeup since the sponge, I don't know. I'm getting older and I feel like the sponge is not working for my skin as it used to. The package does say for light or full coverage, so I am going to be giving this a test in my next video. I did get it for $5.99 and it does retail for $8, which is what it says here. So I feel like that was pretty cool um that is pretty much it for all that i got at marshall's um but yeah bye guys see you guys next time don't forget to give a like a thumbs up and subscribe share my video you guys i need views i need you guys to view my video come on help a girl out bye bye